is Manchester United 2, Galatasaray 3. Manchester United back-to-back -back Champions League defeats, back-to-back -back home defeats at Old Trafford. A stinker, a stinker of a result for us. When we were just winning, we kept on conceding straight away. This team really pisses me off it pisses you off too and look at it now it's probably Eric Ten Hag trending all over the place because why he also stanked up the place you know persistently choosing players like Marcus Rashford starting Bruno Fernandes himself Mason Mount all of you mans here can't play possession based football but you persist on them you want to play possession based football this is not me even saying Eric Ten Hag out I'm just saying that you it will be an Eric Ten Hag out soon Probably should be this weekend. Yeah, if you continue this nonsense, you know, because what I'm seeing on the pitch and the performances is not good. And those players as well, those players as well, guys, they truly suck. They suck and they, they can go and go and suck on a lemon too because them guys make our face go like, it's mm, like suck on a lemon because we don't like what we are seeing. You know what? Big up to men like Hoyland, you know, because Hoyland, I feel sorry for you. I'm a Manchester United fan. You played your best today. You almost got a hat trick as well. But certain mans let you down. Certain other man Cunians, man Manchester United fans like, i.e., Marcus Rashford. Even though, besides the assists, which I don't give a damn about, yeah, you was rubbish. You was trash. Bruno Fernandes, the captain of Manchester United, guys. Another game where he was non-existent. Like, where was Bruno? We was playing where's Wardo with Bruno Fernandes because we never fucking see him in those big games, those crucial matches where we need him to be representing and showing himself to be the man that he's supposed to be is. But no, he ain't the man. He ain't, the sh he ain't anything. He's never been that guy, bruh. We've just been conned for the last couple of years. Call up HM Revenue and Custom because there's been some fraudulent activities with this account of Bruno Fernandes, bruv. He deets his, account, his figures, man. His GAs, all deets, man. I'll be honest with you. All fraudulent activities, man. Scams and everything. But yeah, man. Today, Manchester United have showed us that they have no balls, man. You know, an important game, a must-win game as well for the Champions League campaign. And they have let us down once again and let everyone else, like the manager down as well, with the club, everyone. This club is in absolute tatters, guys. That first 45 minutes where Manchester United started off well in control of the game as well. But again, both of the teams were still in the, both of the, teams were still in the game, you know. Manchester United scoring that first goal. Marks Rashford, which I thought, are you going to cross or are you going to gonna shoot? And I thought he was going to take a shot, but he decided to take a cross to find Rajmus Hoyland's header. What a powerful header with no option but to go into the back of the net, yeah? Which was a very good assist by Marcus Rashford. But six minutes later, guys, you men cannot hold a, a, a goal, a win at the moment. We cannot hold it. We score a goal, we can see straight away. It's like karma. Whatever what goes around comes back around, but it comes back around 12 times fast and slap us in the face, bruv. Because these guys equalize straight away. Wilfred Zaha. Man, turn around, turn in Diego Dalo. Diego Dalo make it look like a Pocio weakling. And Diego Dalo got rolled over and then Zaha just took a shot, a little deflection. And then, oh, Nana, looking helpless. So, oh, Nana looks useless in goal. Oh, na na! I wasn't even singing that was when I was going. Oh, na 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 na! Yeah, 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 yeah! That was what we was doing today because that guy made mistakes, especially later on, which we will talk about. After that equaliser, it was one one at half time. Highland did score a goal, but it was removed and disallowed us offside, which was rightly so. But then Highland came, got the ball, solo run, got forward as well. And then finished it lovely and wonderful pace and power. And again, we was in heaven. But what do Manchester United do? You no, know, crash it back down in reality. Give us another slap on the face. And four minutes later, we concede a goal to Akito, Akito Glue, whatever his name is. Ato Kolo Glue, whatever his name is, bruv. I don't give a shit. But then that guy, Onana, you know. Oh, na, 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 yeah, 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 with a stupid pass. Wait, what was the concentration? And this is, is in Onana's game. Lack of concentration from this guy. Giving the ball to the defence, I mean, the players of Galatasaray, where 
Casemiro had no option but to go in for a slight tackle and that was his second yellow card and it was a red card and then they missed the penalty. Icardi missed the penalty. But Icardi did make up for it later on. Again, Manchester United defence looking poor. Yes, 10 men. <sighs> Icardi getting through and dinking it over Onana. Onana is shit, guys. Onana's not good. Nah, I want David to hear back. I want a refund on Onana. Bro, what is this, bro? What kind of keeper is this? Every time, every shot that goes at him, it goes, at, it goes through him easily. He's not good. Now, nah, try the next keeper. Because he probably might be better than Onana. But today, I'm fuming. I'm pissed. Manchester United again let me down. Let us down. A must win game, guys. And yeah, they fuck up badly. They mess up. Buddy, they're making me swear. They're making me want to do all sorts of things, but but bruh, they really stress me out and they stress you guys out, man. What a poor performance for Man United today, you know, overall because it's turned off so well, so much opportunity, but to end like that, poor. Player wise today, guys, Hoyland was superb. You know, the two goals, even the disallowed goals. Now he deserved way more than that. He deserved a hat trick today. But he didn't get that. His players let him down. Players like Marcus Rashford, Bruno Fernandes, Mason Mount. Why are you in my team? Just why? Why? Why are you in my team? You contribute nothing. You, what, what are you there for? Especially Bruno Fernandes giving the ball away. Mason Mount, why was you signed for so much money? And Marcus Rashford, 350 bags for what? For what? You conned us. You gave us fair goals to Carnos so you can get a new contract. But once you got that new contract, you're settling, innit? You are settled. You are comfortable. You don't feel like you need to work extra hard. Rashford is rubbish, man. I don't care what everyone says, man. Rashford, I've said it for so many years, inconsistent. Making the wrong decision 24-7. He had an opportunity to square Bruno Fernandes and he didn't. He failed in that. What a poor, 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 poor decision making he has in his brain. I don't know how the, that process works there, but boy, 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 it's, it doesn't reach the half, and it doesn't even reach for hundred percent when it's like a CPU or computer that processes it. I feel like Marcus Rashford will always get stuck on fifty percent and just stay there. Seriously, when he's loading in that computer of his. Oh, what a poor game, man! And and, and Casemiro, uh, which was good at times. But awful as well. And that change, bringing Casemiro uh, Eriksen in for um, for Hannibal was a mistake. You should have taken off Bruno Fernandes on Mason Mount if you wanted control. The manager as well, you look rubbish, you look suspect. Your team doesn't play any wave and no, no philosophy. And we are fucked. We are truly are fucked. We, we don't know what we're going to do anymore. Like, it's done and dusted for us, man. Man United flopped today, man. Man of the match today, guys. Has to go to Hoyland. Don't give the match. I think I'm going. I'm giving that to Bruno, Rashford, Mount, and Onano, and also the manager because the manager was stinking as well, bro. The substitution again, horrible. Kept us open and we conceded the goal. What was he thinking? But yeah, it is what it is, guys. But this guys has been your match reaction. Let me know what your thoughts on in the comments as well. Let me know who your man the matches as well, and let me know who your donkey the matches as well. Like seriously. I'm fuming. But try keep it united, guys, and remember to keep it ready united because your boy is out. Bun this team, man. This team is shit, man. Peace, guys.